Hello guys, welcome back. Um, so, is it bricks or plaster? Well, that's plaster at the top. Um, yeah, I'm sure you guessed it. I'm going to create a brick effect on the plaster at the bottom along the base. So, I'm going to show you a couple of wee steps. I'll show you the inside too. The owner actually built everything here himself. So, yeah, I think he's done a good job. And we have to follow the footsteps. So, guys, um, finished. We'll let us all the outside work by the base here. And the owner wants it matched in. Make his brick work so he can paint it. Paint it and it'll look the same. So, we'll be doing that right off to where he's done the step as well. So, I'll show you as far as I want to do it. Let me set it in. Let me set it in. There's actual tools for this. There's pointing tools you can use, and there's also cutting tools you can use as well. But this will be fine. So what I want to do is get all my lines done like that and then I'll come back and do the ones that are go up and down. I'll give you a wee look at that when we're all done. Right, so guys, I uh, used the fight pit top but it was pretty slow so I opted for a, a 
pointer. Point and turn instead, it was a bit quicker, and you can see it's even a pretty neat. I'll obviously clean it all down. I'll give you a quick look at it. Just wanted to show you doing some verticals. Should have been plumb anyway, as you would imagine they are all level anyway. You can see when we first started this, it was quite wet and it is setting. Which, you don't want it to go too hard either or you'll never get a good mark in it. So this is it all done, finished, cleaned, um, about to go home so I just thought I'll show you the whole job finished. Um, the owners really delighted how it came up, they didn't even want the back done, they just wanted it smooth but thought nah, I may as well match it in, have it all looking proper. Um, so yeah, it's not bricks, it's plaster, they're going to paint it all the same the way, right, right, way around the house. Um, the ice is well dried out, so we're having really good weather here. As you can see, the ground's completely dry, and it was it was absolutely pelting down this morning. So it was. Um, so it all patched in very well along the top there as well. So you should be able to paint that in really good. And as I said, guys, the owner actually did all the block work himself. He's put that subfloor in himself. He's pla he plasterboard the ceiling himself. Um, put in the big steel beam, the big there's a supporting steel beam from that post that I just soon passed to the other post on the other side of the room, which is holding the wee roof up above as well. So I think the owner has actually done quite a lot of really good work himself. I think he's an electrician by trade, so he would know a good bit about the building himself. Um, there's a wee bit of shine on the ceiling there. She actually used Rafina Travel, so but that's another video. So it is. Um, and there's the box I was telling you about. Where he's brought that up and bolted it to the steel beam that's up enclosed in the ceiling. So yeah guys, that's that's this job complete and hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, and I'll see you again soon.